Hi, I'm Esther Bryant, and I want to invite you to imagine with me for a minute. Picture yourself walking to your car alone at night. You hear footsteps walking behind you, and they seem to be getting closer and closer and closer. And just as you go to reach into your bag, bam, he grabs your arm. You start shuffling around looking for your phone, and your bag falls. And you wish so desperately that there was a discreet way to contact your family and friends. Well, now there is. I introduce to you Safeable. Like the prototypes you see in front of you, Safeable is a small discreet device that can be worn directly on the skin. It works by being connected to an app via Bluetooth. If you're in an unsafe situation, you'll click the button three or more times, and this will send an alert message to your phone asking if you're okay. You can disarm the message by putting in your code, or if you do nothing for 30 seconds, it will send a message to a predetermined list of family and friends. If you're in an extremely dangerous situation, then you'll hold the button for three or more seconds, still sending that alert message to your phone asking if you're okay, and if no input is received within 30 seconds, it'll send your location to campus police. As passionate as I am about this company, I'm not reinventing the wheel. There's already a clip, a ring, a watch, and a necklace that basically do the same thing. The clip is not discreet. The necklace and the watch clash with everyday wear, like your Fitbit, your Apple Watch, or the necklace your best friend got you for Christmas. And, excuse me, Savable has discovered a way to overcome all of these obstacles. We're discreet because you can wear it under your skin and it's under your clothes and it's super small. And it also doesn't clash with your everyday design accessories. Not to mention, we're pretty affordable at only $50 a unit with double-sided medical grade tape being sold at $10 a pack. After pitching this to investors, developers, and a business mentor, they suggested that we do our first round of testing at Ball State's campus, which is actually live right now with a few college girls. So I'm not asking you to vote for Just Safeable today. I'm asking you to vote for a better future. Vote for your daughter, your niece, or your best friend to finally have a safer campus experience. Thank you.